Yes. Ha ha. Fighting games, man. They're hard as hell, with tons of button commands and jargony language to memorize. I recently had the chance to check out Street Fighter VI's closed beta test though, and while I was definitely getting my ass cheeks clapped, one of the biggest takeaways I had was how impressive the training mode was. Seriously, this training mode might be the best I've seen in a fighting game. What makes Street Fighter VI's so special is how approachable and informative it is. This bears out in the training mode presets, where you can learn about punishing missed moves, countering air attacks, and breaking out of throws, which are cheap as hell. The frame data meter I found especially helpful. You might have heard high level players talk about the importance of frames before, but you've probably never seen it demonstrating in a training mode like this. It's like a senpai teaching you the ropes while not giving you all the answers to the test. Throughout Street Fighter VI's beta test, thanks to the training mode presets, I truly felt my skills as a Shoto warrior improving. To be clear, I was still getting bodied, but there was some improvement. That's more than I can say about most training modes in fighters that tell through move lists rather than show you how to get good with actionable, quantitative data. Instead of just, I don't know, sending you off to a YouTube guide or something, Street Fighter VI's training mode actually wants you to learn the game's mechanics and succeed in competitive settings. Training mode can help you though when Jury kicks your dome in with her finely manicured feet. What makes a fighting game's training mode useful to you? Let us know in the comments below.